What it do, homies? It's your boy, David. I'm back today. We're back with another donation request. This time we are checking out Ball in Reverse coming home. Let's go ahead and shut up and turn it up. Oh, bro, I'm going to tell you something. I didn't know where this was going. It started off with a felt piano, and then they put a filter on it, and then kind of opened it up prematurely with some distortion before it went straight into mega apocalyptic mode. Whole bunch of choir, not a choir, but just yelling, kind of giving us that early 2000s kind of sound and everything with the whoa, right? And then it divided, and then it came down to a, like some type of distorted bass. I thought maybe he was about to. I don't know, take us to, to, to dubstep town or something like that uh, with, the, with the way that the bass was sounding. And then he's about to start singing. What? <laughs> I feel like this man done fused like 12 different genres in just 30 seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, following in reverse. Tell me who you are. This bass. Your father has forsaken you. Left you. This is bro, this 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 definitely has a sound, has an anthem sounding, right? Um, you know, sometimes you gotta go back and you gotta go back in time, all right? Because I never heard this version of Ronnie singing. I had no idea he was I mean, he, he's a very talented guy, right? Sometimes you don't know what you don't know. Uh, but going, you know, most of the stuff I have reactions to is his most recent stuff, you know, stuff that was released in maybe like the, the last two or three years. And so, right, this is a six year old song, or at least it was dropped on, in, you know, on, uh, six years ago. And this just gives me a whole nother level of respect for Ronnie, right? Now, when I, you know, because because in order for you to understand what they're doing right now, you got to go back and see what they've been doing when it been done. And then you go and look at their recent stuff and you're like, oh, okay, okay, that, that says a lot. Because his, his new style is crazy. It's but noodles. It's a new style, right? I don't know how much rapping he was doing back in these times because lately... <laughs> You know, he done built up the fundamentals doing music like this. Very, very cinematic, very powerful. A lot of emotions and stuff in his voice. I'm loving it. This might be a fun song to sing karaoke. Your throat might be gone by the end of the song, but you're going to enjoy it. Everybody going to enjoy it. Everybody yelling it with you. Transmission from the stars. A message from the atmosphere. Etched into my heart Your purpose there is still unclear The ghost of you lives on Through everything I see and touch And even when you're gone Even if it's hard Even when I'm far I will always be Oh! 
you know, I can I can see this song being a very, very powerful song that you want to listen to over and over again for a multitude of reasons. But the number one reason that I'm thinking of right now is people who are kind of like like discharged into the military, right? This is kind of like one of them songs that you can just sing to yourself, especially when you get like real homesick. This wasn't like something that was dedicated to the to the troops, is it like purposely? I don't think so. Okay. But for for a multitude of reasons, right? Death, um, um, you really, really missing somebody, um, sickness, all kinds of stuff, man. No matter what kind of stage in life, if it's something that you're yearning for, especially when it comes to like like a missing or I mean, and this song gets more more tied to, you know, that that yearning feeling of 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 something that you're wanting a person that you're wanting but you're not simply there but you're on your way you know what i mean i love this this is it's so ah, his vocals is just so powerful so passionate man he's come on now come on Coder. That's unique. self-destruct sequence now. Powerful stuff, bro. Powerful music. Stuff that I've been missing out on. And then, you know, as far as the video goes, the concept and everything, you know, person kind of lost in space, how you kind of uh, pretty much kind of like lost in life. Right. And then him entering the atmosphere, you know, the, the entry into the atmosphere is a, you know, most people are not going to survive it unless you're shielded or whatnot. So you can kind of look at it as a sense of Hey, I'm coming home, but I got to kind of fight heaven and hell tooth and nail, you know, in order to get to you. Right. I got to suffer some 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 blows. It's not going to be as easy as as just walking up and being there. Right. I got to fight through some things, um, um, which which points to a reason why he's saying hold on because I'm coming home. And it also speaks to the passion and the intensity and how he's singing it to kind of give you a sense that it's a struggle, but I'm on my way there. So just hold on. You know what I mean? So anyways, that's the end of this video. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and subscribe. Dave's out.